when you're out on the street, guys, I always say you don't want to get dirty. You don't want to fall down to the ground with the guy. So when you get behind him, when you do this move, let's say I'm here and I'm pummeling. He pummels inside. He pummels inside again. I hit the angle and I get to here. Guys, if I do this trip, it's not bad, but let's say I go here. Boom, and I bring him down. We're on top of the guy, but now we're grappling. And if we're out on concrete, I don't want to do this. You know, if I take this guy down, I would rather not do that. What if he's got buddies? What if we're, my, 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 I'm going to get some grass stains? If we're on grass, I'm going to scuff up my knees. What if I'm wearing shorts on concrete? I don't want to do that. So, pummel. Okay, pummel again. I get the position. Now, did you see what I just did? I just went to my knee. I was just okay. talking about, all right, here's the move without going to your knee. That's the sportive way. See, even coach makes mistakes. Here we go. Try to get that under. See how I work behind you? Now that I'm here, now watch guys. Whether I have his arm trapped or not, he even pull it out, limp arm it out, that's fine. Watch what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take this elbow and drop it right here into his hip and put pressure on his hip, okay, and on his quadriceps. As I put pressure right here, I'm leaning off to the side and I'm gonna put my foot right here and I'm gonna take my knee and I'm gonna buckle his knee inward. Stay like that, okay? Don't move. Once he, he's like this, I'm pushing weight that way, forward and to the side, and then what it means is I can move my foot. So once I break him in, at the last second, I can move my foot. I make him fall to his knees, and then now once you guys are here, you're on top. If you wanna just disengage, and soccer kick the face, you could do that. If you wanted to hop on top, you like them? If you want to hop on top and rear naked choke, you can do that. If you want to set your hooks, you can do that. If you just want to knee his body or, or, or break him down like a wrestling match, you could break him down like a wrestling match. So, here we go. Here, underhook, underhook, and I'm coming around. Once I'm here, now watch guys. See how I brought him down. All I did was buckle that knee for a split second and then I kept my balance so I don't have to get dirty if I don't want to. And now once I'm on top of him, we're ready to go right here. We can start striking and going to work. Get in, get some wrist control. You know, if we want to bump him down, we can bump him down and grapple down here. Get to me on belly, get to here. So 